I'm gonna do a voiceover for this video, but I wanted to like talk first. I went to Bill Park with my boyfriend and his family, um, and I took some really like fun reference pictures to draw from. So that's what this video is. Well, it's not the references; it's me drawing from them at home because I'll show you the ones we tried to do there, and I'll explain what happened. Okay, these are the ones that I did while we were there. This peacock made us fall off a bench. Basically, we were sat on one of those benches with a table. We both sat on the same side. I had my sketchbook on the table, drawing, and this peacock came under the table, and we both leaned back to look, and the table <laughs> fell on us. So, yeah, I didn't get very far with drawing actually at the park, so I decided to paint them with gouache when I got home because I prefer painting. And after that, I was just traumatized, to be honest. So yeah, so that's what this is. Enjoy. Okay, so I took a lot of videos at the actual park. Um, but they do kind of fizzle out towards the end, but uh, right now I'm sketching a tortoise. Uh, I got some really cool pictures of them, but I didn't actually take any videos. Um, oh, I love meerkats. Um, so this is from a picture I took, but I don't have any videos of them. Oh, look at him. Recently I've really got into using mechanical pencils to sketch, I, d I don't know why, they just make me more precise with what I'm doing. And here I'm just putting in the, the base yellow. I think I forgot to film the rest of this. Yep, yeah, I did. <laughs> Good job. Uh, so that's the finished one for that. That, took, that probably took me about 20 minutes. I love the lemurs. There's a little baby one, he kept trying to jump on the same tree and falling. But this is my sketch, and then I forgot to film the lemur as well, which is clever. Uh, and here's a little piggy. Um, I had to draw him, because he was just so sleepy. Um, I just thought he looked really cute with his eye closed because you can't really see his eye because his face is so like fat and hairy. So this is just a sketch for that. There's not really much more I can say about that really. Um, for this one I actually decided to use complementary colours. Uh, and I'm not sure if I like it but I decided to try it, um, but I've been really into using purple at the moment for animals, so I did that here as well. I actually really struggled with this pig, I don't know why, I just couldn't figure out where to put the lines for the hair, because they're not like completely furry, oh you can probably hear my dog. Um, they're just like wiry. So at this point, I'm just adding in the highlights, really, filling in the floor. And I decided to add some blue. I'm not really sure why. It just felt the whole time like it was missing something. So I added that. I don't know if it helped or not, really. Dogs is barking, be quiet. More highlights, these are blue again. I don't know why I felt like the blue would help, but I just kept doing it. And now I'm just adding in a background color because I always like to do that. 
don't know why. And that one's finished. And these are all of the things that I made in this video. Um, I showed these ones. I didn't show these. Uh, they're just sketches, so yeah. Thanks for watching.